Hi guys, this is Kara. We're back again with another video showcasing Ramos abilities, combos, runes, spells, and item build. We know that you're excited to use this champion, so this guide will surely be under 6 minutes. Without further ado, let's jump right in. Ramos the Armordello Idolized by many, dismissed by some, mystifying to all, the curious being, Ramos is an enigma. You're right, just look at his face, no doubt, he is an enigma. Anyways, his rule is a tank obviously because of the spiked shell in his back and he is commonly played in the jungle. Okay. Here are Ramos' kills. His passive is called Rolling Armadillo. While out of combat, Ramos gained 60 MS and increased to 180 during Power Ball. Exit combat after not taking damage or using abilities for 5 seconds. His first kill is called Power Ball. Enables Rolling Armadillo and accelerates up to 180% bonus MS over 6 seconds. Colliding with an enemy deals 240 magic damage in an area, knocking back and slowing enemies by 70% for one second. Activating cancels defensive ball curl and puts it on cooldown. His second skill is called defensive ball curl. Brace for up to 6 seconds, slowing Ramos by 30% while gaining 156 armor and 41 magic resist. While curled spiked, Shell deals 50% more damage and also applies to enemies that attack Ramas. Activating cancels Power Ball and puts it on cooldown. His third skill is called Frenzying Taunt. Taunts an enemy champion or monster for 2 seconds and gain 80% attack speed for 5 seconds. His ultimate is called Soaring Slam. Hop into the air and slam down, dealing 275 magic damage. 275 plus 50 and creating aftershocks for 4 seconds. Aftershocks deal 85 magic damage every second and slow enemies incrementally by 16%, stacking up to 80%. Soaring Slam's range increases with movement speed. Aftershocks damage structures. So here are his rooms. Aftershock. Since Ramos' abilities are full of slows, this rune will give an armor buff, so he will be more tanky. Weakness Again, since Ramos got a lot of slow abilities, this rune is beneficial for him as the enemies marked by this take 5% more damage. Conditioning After 5 minutes, Ramos will gain 8 bonus attack resist and magic resist, really good for a tank like him. Pathfinder he is an initiator and this will give his ultimate more range since it gives him 8% more movement speed. So here are his recommend items on Wild Drift. Block Cleaver Gives Ramos 350 plus health, 25 ability haste and 30 attack damage. This synergies will with his frenzy taunt as Black gives an armor reduction to enemy champs as well. Plated Steel Cops for more armor and move speed. Thornmail Synergies while with his frenzy taunt will inflict grievous wounds for 3 seconds and it will return the enemy's damage. Abyssal Mask provides 300 max health, 40 magic resist, 300 max mana, and 10 ability haste. Also, since Ramos is a magical dealer tank, Nearby enemy champs will take 15% more bonus damage. Deadman's Plate More armor and max health. These items passive gives Ramas more movement speed thus improving his ultimate range. Randuin's Omen More armor and max health for Ramas. These items passive gives Ramas a critical strike reduction from enemy champs and reducing their attack speed by 15% for 1.5 seconds. Spells Smite and Flash Powerball 
can be used as an effective escape mechanism. Tremors and Defensive Ball Curl Can be used late in the game to obliterate towers. If you're back down in a teamfight, it is often available to break off and attack the buildings. That's it for today's video. If you find the video helpful, please do like the video and subscribe for more videos like this. Till next time, be a legend.